What's up, y'all? Big Kirk 916. And I just want to say, I wish I had a dad like LeVar Ball. Yeah, LeVar Ball, he's a great dad. He's there for his kids. He takes care of his wife. He's a marketing genius, a social media animal. And the guy, he knows how to get it cracking. You know, a lot of dads want to hate on LeVar Ball or they want to hate on what he's, you know, been able to accomplish. For what? Why you want to hate on him? Why are you jealous that you didn't make the same moves? That's what it boils down to. You wish you would have took more time with your kids and went to the, the basketball games, the, the little league uh, baseball games or the football games instead of being a motherfucking deadbeat. That's why you mad. You can't tell me there's not one person in the NBA or college basketball that wish they didn't have a dad like LeVar Ball speaking for them. All these kids sitting around, parents quiet, they watching the, the draft, hoping that their child's going to get picked up. Nah, LeVar went out there and he, he campaigned. He made sure his son got picked up and then got him to the Lakers. Yeah, that's some ingenious ass shit. You know, yeah, he might talk a little crazy, but hey, man, he's not out blowing weed, uh, sipping on lean, uh, getting caught with pistols. He ain't doing stupid shit like that. So the stuff he is doing serves a purpose. He's actually smarter than a lot of you guys think. Who else gets the president to tweet back and forth with him? To talk publicly about them. Who who else does that? Who else gets ESPN to give them 20 minutes of airtime arguing over an international scandal? And we don't even know if the kid really got caught stealing. It might have just been a market employee. This dude's a monster. And man, I commend you, man. As a father, you're a motherfucking role model. And you know, a lot of people are going to hate on this video... But I really don't give a damn, man, because I didn't have a dad, and I wish I would have had somebody speaking up for me, somebody that would have been pushing me and keeping my ass in check. A lot of you little niggas need somebody like that to keep you in check, so you don't go, off, you know, off astray. You know, you need you need a male role model in your life, and not just a male role model, somebody who's gonna campaign for you, who's gonna believe in you. He never says nothing negative about his kids. He always backs them up. He don't ever talk greasy about him. He ain't never said anything derogatory about any of his sons. That that's that's what they want him to do. They want him to say something bad about him, but nah, he don't bite. He a real G, man. This dude from the hood, you know, came from nothing, you know, run his mouth, got his got his mouthpiece cracking, got endorsement deals, you know, got his kids in a in a proper position to where they can uh, step their game up, get paid, get endorsements. Man, he's a straight sav, man. LeVar Ball is a straight sav when it comes to business, you know. And he, he, this is all stuff to me It looks like he's self-taught. There's not too many dads that can sit around and say that they've done that for their kids. And they, some people say, oh, he goes too far. How far did he really go? He ain't in jail. He ain't committing no crimes. So he ain't, went, he ain't went that far. He's not stupid. You just hating, man. Quit hating on the man. This dude has been there for his kids throughout their life, so how is he a bad dad? Are you mad because your son ain't made it to the league or you ain't been able to accomplish what he's accomplished for his kids? That's why you're really mad. Man, I wish I had a dad like that. I wish I had a, a father figure that believed in me that would have pushed me and got me to do the things I should have been doing instead of running the motherfucking streets, instead of being a knucklehead. It's one thing to scold your kids, but to actually have an impact on him, he had an impact on his kids. His sons all respect him and have been able to accomplish great things. I commend this man for being father of the motherfucking century, man, because with that type of role model, you can go far in life, and I give this guy props. Shout out to LeVar Ball. Much love, man, and I uh, hope one day I can, you know, kick it with you, man, because uh, you're a hell of a role model and a great father figure.